Hi, my name's Gav. If you're new here, let me tell you that I'm someone that loves life. I like spending quality time with friends and family. I'm also someone that loves traveling. I love visiting new places and trying new things. I have two hobbies. I love singing and I love skating. I've been skating ever since I was a little boy. And fun fact, I actually do it now professionally. Yes, I'm a professional figure skater. This is what this channel's all about. Tag along as I bring you on board a cruise ship in my crazy life as a professional figure skater. Good morning, guys. Today is June 10th, and we are in Riga, Latvia, I believe, if I'm not mistaken. We have been here since yesterday, but I couldn't get off yesterday because we got there at, or at around uh, 1 p.m. and we had shows for some reason on the overnight. They like to schedule our shows on the overnight, which is kind of weird because everybody's off the ship. But anyways, I can get off today, so right, right now it's 9 a.m. Uh, I slept in a little bit because I finished sleep yesterday. But yeah, I'm going to go visit. I believe it's a 30-minute drive to the old town, but I do think they have some shuttles for us. So I'm probably going to hop on one of those shuttles and just head to the old town. I wanted to bike, but it's supposed to rain. And as you, I don't know if you can see, there's a camera for the front of our ship. And I think it's raining already. And it's so unfortunate because yesterday it was sunny and it was a like a really nice summer day. And then today, the day that we get off to visit, it's raining. I hate the weather here, guys. It pisses me off. Anyways, let's go and get the day started. Okay, so I'm off the ship. I believe they do have shuttles for us, which is quite fun because I did not want to pay for a taxi just to get downtown. The port here, disgusting. It kind of smells bad and it's just like an industrial port with like train tracks and just a bunch of cranes and um, containers and bleh. So I'm excited to see what downtown is like. I love how we did not even speak to each other and we end up on the same shuttle. So we, and show. we didn't even speak to each other and we end up on the same shuttle at the same time. Should I be facing you? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> this is what I was telling them. This is Latvia. Okay. Did not make a mistake. <laughs> Uh, Wait, now this we're... is super fun. Yes. Oh my God. We're gonna go for brunch. You want to go for brunch? Um, sure. Not sure. Sure. You seem well, to. I just ate. Oh, okay. So, but I could eat again. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> like right now, that one you can. Got three, drink. I think three coins. Uh, I think we are downtown. Now we're trying to walk to the old town. We, <laughs> look, both of us on our cameras. So we did not ask the guy if that was the place they were gonna pick us up. And also we did not ask the guy for directions to the old town. So wish us luck. We'll try to do our best to find our way. Jordan dropped a pin to go back, I did not, so we'll see if we get separated. <laughs> I need coffee. Oh it's it's so hot. Oh they said it was going to be raining. I let the sun shine. No. <laughs> Should have told me that yesterday. I brought my bike out. 
Anyways. I wish I didn't wear the jacket, to be honest with you. Because... Now it's, it's going to be annoying to carry. But this is the beauty of a tote. Look at that. Amazing. Oh, so I'm now I'm now. trying to find a breakfast place to get coffee in me. And what else do I want? Are you going to survive? I don't know if I'm going to survive. I just need coffee. I hear a car, but this is a pedestrian street, so we should be fine. Mm, I don't know. It's really early still, so I think. What time is it? <laughs> I just walked in your shot. <laughs> I was grumpy. We've sat and he's already better. I'm better. I just, that was the, my plan. It was like, okay, we're getting off, we're getting some coffee and breakfast, and then we can get started. And she wanted to explore. So I was like. <laughs> um, but look at this view, guys. And we're at this, oh. <laughs> What, look at my vlogging technique. <laughs> you were really all over the place. We're at this place called... Kitariga. Kitariga. With a gorgeous view of this beautiful church. I'm gonna have breakfast, I'm gonna have coffee, and then I'm gonna start exploring. <laughs> Just write <laughs> potato pancake down in your paper, thanks. I was like... He's yeah. coming back. I told you he was coming back. <laughs> <laughs> I told you. Oh no, he got scared. He, I think he heard me. Okay, so what happened? is that I'm grumpy. <laughs> but once I get my first coffee, I'll be fine. So hopefully he'll bring my cappuccino first. But I asked him also, I think there was a language barrier. I don't care. <laughs> it's okay, I accept you as you are and love you as you are. So <laughs> I asked for the omelets, but then you can add like bacon, you can add cheese, you can add mushrooms, and you can add mixed vegetables. And they all have different prices. And I asked the oh guy, God, I was like, orange juice. Yum. Oh, but it's, it's seven like euros. Seven euros. <laughs> Maybe like they don't, oranges are rare. Yeah. It's, it's not like buy. Florida. Anyways, so. <laughs> Off on a tangent, as usual. Yes. So then I was like, I just want mixed vegetables. He's like, all ingredients? No, mixed vegetables. It's 73, I'm oh, sorry. <laughs> and then I wanted the potato pancake, but he didn't get that as well. So I just said, write that on your sheet. Potato pancake, and I think they'll understand. <laughs> but if you see my coffee, guys, that's what you don't understand. It's like I can't function without coffee. Yeah, like I love coffee. I could have ten, but I don't. Could also go a day without coffee because I don't feel like I wake up and I'm. Oh, I crave it. it. But you. I think I'm addicted to coffee. Yeah. Unfortunately, but that's okay. Mm. It's a good addiction. And he said we had none, so. I got an espresso. Wait, I want to do it. Okay. Dude, how cute is that? Oh, it smells like my stomach's gonna rumble after this. <laughs> it's no slight milk. <laughs> That's why I asked. Oh my god! Especially cappuccino. This is literally so basic, but sugar cube. Bye. I think you have to break it or something. No, it's supposed to be hot and melt it. I don't think it's working. <laughs> it's okay. Cheers. Don't choke on your sugar cube. <laughs> Wait, you're not in it. There we go. Cheers. Done my omelet. I did order a vegetable omelet. It smells but phenomenal though. I don't think I don't think he understood the vegetable part, but that's okay. It's just the language barrier, I think. Hopefully. Also, I was grumpy and rude, so maybe that's why. Maybe he purposely lifted it up. <laughs> he's like, um, he wanted vegetables, but he's mean. <laughs> Look at how large and in charge he is. <laughs> <laughs> just caught the end of her vlog. So, like she said, she just updated her vlog to tell her people that we had the worst serving experience of our lives. Literally, the guy made mistakes in every single thing he did. There was not one right thing he did. Even the check was wrong. <laughs> it's okay. I didn't pay for my salmon, but I was, I didn't ask for salmon. 
So, <laughs> so, <laughs> I should not have paid for my he salmon. He didn't even know what to do. Like, he had just, the thing is, is after he could have typed in, he could have just subtracted three euros, you know? But, but no. he was just like, I am so sorry. I'm so sorry. That's all late. he was saying. And he was trying to catch up with me by complimenting my tattoos. And I was like, no, it's too late, honey. So now we're going in this church because we met Alex and Pasha for, well, they uh, stopped by at breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> you guys look nice. And then we're gonna go visit this church and see, because they went in and they said it was pretty. I believe they have something going on at 12. Today at 12, organ music, 20 minutes. Oh, it's inside. Church was $10, a 10 euros anyways, and we didn't want to pay for it because we go to a million other ports, which these, they all have churches and they're all free. So we were just like, well, not worth it. So now we're just going to the, it's a Holocaust museum because I do believe they had a concentration camp here in, um, it's Riga, right? Here? Riga, ghetto, Latvia. and yeah, that's what I said, Riga, ghetto, and Latvian Holocaust Museum. Okay, so we're going to the museum right now. It's like a 15 minute walk. So we're just walking there. It's quite busy. I, I can't, I don't even know if they can hear me right now. I hope so. <laughs> Probably, because I have a microphone on. Also, do we know which bus we have to get back on? No. I didn't even check the bus. No. We can just text Pasha and Alex for the bus. There you go. Anyways, so we're going to walk for 15 minutes, go to that museum. I'm excited to visit and like see history up front. I've never actually been to a like World War II museum. We read, I read all about it in school. It so. was my favorite my favorite topic to learn about. Mm -hmm. So I'm, ex I'm excited to see how it's going to make me feel, how like how it was back then, and to read a little bit about the history. So we're heading there. Okay, so we just researched what ghetto means. Before to live there, um, its vicinity to the ghetto where the non-Jewish inhabitants were evicted, uh, the Nazis transported a large number of German Jews to the ghetto. Most of them were later killed in mass killings. Okay, so this is the place they were temporarily put them before sending them to concentration camps. So I was mistaken. This is not a concentration camp. This is just a place where they would put the Jews, they would live in here, and that was like the typical home of what a Jew sort of ghetto home would look like, and they had poor living qualities, but they said that they tried to keep spirits up just because of the time they were in, and from here they would send them to concentration camps. Ugh, it's a lot. Okay. Now we're heading somewhere else. We just went to the museum. Uh, kind of discouraging. I cried. I cried like four times. It's kind of I discouraging feel... to see humanity and it's sort of 
not repeating itself, but we're it still is. at war, and it's like, people haven't, dying, so haven't we learned people. anything from, like, past history and past mistakes we've done? Anyways. 80 years later. 80 years well, later. All I can do, because it's in the past, so we can't do anything now to save them, or is to live our life the fullest and tribute to them, I guess. That's all we can do. Butterflies are floating like your... Okay, so, um... Me and Jordan are now in a market, it seems. So we're just gonna walk around and see what this market is. They seem to be having a lot. I'm gonna try not to lose Jordan. She's also vlogging on her camera. <laughs> gonna, uh, so we'll see what this market has to offer and then maybe head to the old town after we've toured this market to see more of the history of Riga. Guys. This market is huge. I'm starving. I literally could eat anything they have, but I don't have euros on me. Are you sure they don't take cards? I would just eat like a month. So many berries. I'm thirsty. I'm thirsty. <laughs> no, I don't think they take cards. Maybe inside. We stopped in a grocery store. I got apricots. I got, do I have enough blueberries? Let me know. <laughs> And she says she's gonna eat a whole one, and I'm gonna eat one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight apricots because I love them. Oh, guys. Okay, so we're walking back to the old town. Me and Jordan just stopped by this art gallery. We're gonna go check it out. I just ate eight apricots. I feel nauseous. That was too many apricots all at once. Oh, this is fancy. Probably. This is it. It's like pop art. Okay, so we just stopped. I got my patch of this country because I haven't been to this country yet. Jordan's gonna eat her blueberries because we just found out it was a little cute basket. It's like a clutch. <laughs> bag. And I did see a church where I believe we can walk up to. So oh my God, we're gonna I go check that out. Jordan's just eating blueberries. So me and Jordan just stopped for yogurt and her blueberries. There's the bee right there. And we're gonna go check gonna out. out. We're gonna go see if we can actually walk up this uh, tower. Cause I did notice some people up there. So if we can, then we'll walk up. If we can't, then we'll keep moving. But so far we're having a good day, right? Even with my grumpy morning, the terrible service we had at brunch, we're still managing to have a wonderful day. And the good thing is that it hasn't rained since we got here, and it was 90% chance of rain. So we are lucky. Since this morning as well. Okay guys, so I just put my card in this really sketchy ATM. And also we do have like our company card because my Visa card is locked because they thought I was- International, they thought it was fraud. They thought it was fraud because I was using it in Europe but I have to call them and I don't have any service to call them to unlock it. So I use the company card, which is like a little weird MasterCard, but I got money out. So we're good. We're gonna go up the tower. There's our 20 euros. <gasps> Whoa! No! Oh no. Oh, 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 <laughs> the bird's just oh, eating the oh, pigeon. <laughs> oh no. Oh, oh my God, I can't even look at it. I can't okay. got that on video. I'm gonna vomit. So that bird just ate another bird. <laughs> <laughs> 
and Jordan oh, <laughs> is having God. trouble processing the fact that it's the circle of life. Oh, <laughs> So we're just soaking, soaking in the views. It's beautiful up here. The weather is a little overcast and I think it has started raining a little bit. Because I do feel some raindrops. But wow, this is the best nine euros I've spent so far this contract. Definitely better, better experience than, than breakfast. <laughs> it's really cool. It has. Yeah, but this is amazing. Ah, you know? uh, that was really fun. Oh, Jordan, don't look at that. <laughs> the bird's back. <laughs> Well, it's the circle. Of, that's how it works, Jordan. Okay, are you done? Like, come on. <laughs> are you done? He's enjoying his meal. <laughs> I was just so peaceful, and now I'm... Saw that again. We just saw a gorgeous view and then end with a... It's Wait, not a pigeon. It's a seagull eating a pigeon. <laughs> it's a seagull eating a pigeon. Sorry. Yeah. Wait, where is Alex? I can't see. So now we're going to try to meet up with Alex and Pasha. I, be, I do believe they're with a skater from another ship that lives here, so we're gonna go there, I think, and then we're gonna get a shuttle to get back on board because we don't have that much time left. 